My background is actually really diverse. I started as a jazz saxophonist, and so I was very, very lucky at, at sort of a, a young age. My music education was actually not formal lessons, but just pricking, picking up my saxophone, and I grew up in Trenton, New Jersey, which was a, you know, sort of a small little hotbed of jazz, and just grabbing my saxophone and going to gigs, and it was a very good kind of education because it wasn't something where sort of there was a classroom that was separate from the professional life of making music. And that was very, very important to me as a sort of growing up as a, as a young musician and artist that it was always only about making music and the learning process was in the process of making music. They weren't two distinct things. It wasn't sort of a time that you practiced and studied with a teacher versus a time that you played concerts. There was just, for jazz musicians, there's only concerts. There was no practicing. I only have one goal which is to, to have the top music program in Australia and to launch multimedia composition, electronic music and audio engineering program that's unlike anything in the entire world. I want us to be the global center of multimedia composition, electronic music and audio engineering. And it's important that we create an environment which the student can cultivate you know, an authenticity and a truthfulness to the things that they're passionate about and they can develop the courage to pursue them and we can give them an environment in which they can learn and pursue their own learning as strongly and as passionately as possible. I'm always listening to something that, that touches me emotionally and then I can learn something from in terms of audio production. I'm still as fascinated by it as I was when I was nine years old and I heard the first jazz saxophonist improvise. My mother brought me to the library and I heard my first live jazz for the first time and I saw the saxophonist improvising and my mind was just blown because I could not understand where that music was coming from. And, I, and my entire life from that point on has been trying to figure out where it all comes from. And even though I've had sort of the, the finest education and pedigree that money can buy, I feel like I'm not no closer to the answer, but I'm just as enthusiastic about the journey.